Hello, Central Triad Church, and welcome to day seven of 21 days of prayer and fasting. Today's verse is... That the God of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of glory, may give to you the spirit of wisdom and revelation in the knowledge of him. Ephesians 1, 17. Well, how do we get wisdom? What does that What does that mean to you? How does this happen? So in the book of James, it says that we can ask freely and God will give wisdom to those who ask. So the first step is to ask of him and you can receive it. The second part is to study his word. Yeah, big, big proponent of, of reading the Bible. In fact, unfortunately, I personally think a lot of Christians don't take advantage of this. His word has got everything we need in there, whether it's for how to pray, what to pray for, what words to say, um, different scenarios in life, whether you're dealing with kids or a happy marriage or a crazy boss or something like that. God's word, it's its alive. And so it's so important uh, that we read his word daily. Yes. What other things can we use it for? We need to study it, um, but it also holds all of the truth. It holds all of our answers to uh, any questions that we have. Yes. yes, that is very true. You're so wise. Um, but another thing I love is in Ephesians chapter six, it talks about, you know, the uh, when it talks about putting on the armor of God, what's our weapon? How do we fight back? It's the sword of the spirit, right? That's his word. We need to be able to know his word to be able to fight back on how to get through life. Life is tough sometimes, especially if you're fasting, right? There's gonna be a lot of temptations to try to mix in of what you're letting go of. Use his word to give you the answers on how to deal with it or how to get through it or to get victory. But getting knowledge of God is essential. We strongly recommend you read your Bible every day. I talk to my wife every day. So I try to read God's word every single day and she tells me what to do. And I, I learned from that knowledge. And so maybe we should uh, listen to him. There you go. Right? Yeah. So if you're not reading your word, what are you doing? What, what are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? It's like with my hands. I don't know what I'm doing. But welcome to this day seven of 21 days of prayer and fasting at Central Triad Church, where we're transforming lives, producing disciples, and impacting the world.